I just recently got this uh, SanDisk 64 gigabyte um, SD card from Amazon.com, and the reason I got this is because my other SD card, I don't know what was up with it, but it was acting up, and so I decided to just go with the 64 gigabyte, and I just wanted to show you guys the unboxing. So I could read up to speed. It's a speed up to 95 uh, megabytes. It's, is it megabytes or MBS per second? And it's 64 gigabytes. And you could you could record uh, 4K. You could record 4K video with this also. Let's see how it looks. So I'm just gonna open this. And here's the SD card. This packaging. Put that down right there. And I think it also comes with a, a subscription download. It's like a free download for a year subscription for a Rescue Pro Deluxe recovery software. I guess so. If you lose any images, you could just like recover them off this website. So that's pretty dope. Ascendus does this for you. Thank you so much, Sandus. That's awesome. And yeah, here's the SD card. And this is the 95 megabyte, 64 gigabyte SD card. Um, it's supposed to be reading and uh, reading things really fast, I guess. The reason I got this SD card is because I actually had a 64 gigabyte SD card, but it was 80 megabytes per second. And um, it, I don't know, it was acting up on me with the Canon T3i, so I had to get, I was thinking like maybe a faster processor speed, it'll be better for the camera, so that way when it's recording, because I make a lot of short films and stuff like that, that way when it's recording, I could just, um, I don't know, it could just be safer, because sometimes honestly with the Canon T3i, it would stop automatically, and I was wondering why it would stop, but then I was talking to a friend, and um, he recommended to get 90 megabytes or higher, I was thinking about getting it for a while and I thought 80 megabytes would be good, but I guess it wasn't that good for the T3i, so I decided to go 15 more megabytes higher. So yeah, this is beautiful I think. I really do appreciate this. This is the SanDisk 64 gigabyte um, SD card, Extreme Pro SD XC UHS I card. So this is the SanDisk Extreme Pro SD XC. UHS I card. I purchased off of Amazon for about forty-three dollars, and I'll I'll try to put a link in the uh, in the description so you guys could get one of these yourselves and check it out. I really recommend these if you guys are into filming or photography. If you're into filming and stuff like that, try to get like a higher megabyte speed. That's really important. The ninety-five megabytes. That's really that's really fast. Um, some SD cards, they'll, they'll be like 25 megabyte speeds or whatever, you know, like 40 megabyte speeds, you know, but, um, I would really recommend if you're working with like, uh, 1080p or even like 4k, especially get uh, 95 megabytes. So it doesn't crash on you or doesn't stop recording and just keeps on reading it smoothly and efficiently. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'm going to go test this thing out now and I'm going to go make a little short. And I'll try to leave the description in the short of what I make with this.